I thank God because over 40 some years ago, he walked into our banquet. And when he walked into our banquet, I wanted to know who he was. Because at the time, I was praying for Jim to get a husband. And uh, he looked like a good prospect. So I understood that relatives invited him. So I made it my business to make him acquainted with not only me, but with Regina, who told me, Mommy, you have some nerve. Why didn't you put it in the newspaper? I thought I would, because it was time for her to move on. So thank God, after a visit or so out of town, coming back, he called, and I said, hold up. Don't rush and answer right away. <laughs> Lo and behold, he was consistent. And thank God, he asked for a hand in marriage. And Bishop Woodside and I, Consented because of the man of God he is wow. and was, and the way he approached and the respect he did. So I want to thank God for him coming into my life, my family, and I thank God for him being the great man of God he is. I love him so much, and I was grateful because I was able to come from Georgia and be here. And I wish him many, many more blessed days to live and continue to preach the gospel the way he does. He's an awesome man of God, a preacher, and a teacher of the word of God. God bless you. Love you so much, man.